a squirrel-proof lid. Phew. George thought that was a good idea. It sure went on tightly. Too tight? What a mess. George had to do something. The golden liquid tasted good. A lot like apples. But there was just too much of it. Luckily, someone had left behind some empty milk containers. A few more. There had to be a way to stop this thing. That's odd. <sighs> George? Do you know where my yellow hat is? <laughs> oh, boy. Where is it? <laughs> huh. How did that happen? No more bottles. <laughs> oh, gee, he hasn't filled the card yet. Hey, up there, no playing in the trees till all the picking's done, thank you. Oh, I, I, I'm just getting my hat. The Rankins would surely be mad that George ruined all of their apples. You done? <laughs> A fantastic job! All that cider already pressed and bottled? <gasps> Thank you, George! <laughs> huh? George? <laughs> so who'd have thought a monkey would do the hard work while his human friend was outside swinging in the trees? But I, I, I just need... Oh, the important thing is the harvest is in. Uh, that was fast. Wow, this is some operation. Designed and built it myself. See, the apples are washed here, and then we lift them up to the chopper. Mm-hmm, chopped apples give more juice. That's right. We press the juice out of the apples here, and then bottle it down here. <sighs> So George didn't ruin the apples after all. He just turned them into cider. <laughs> You've got an unusual way of stacking. <laughs> yeah, George, if you weren't careful, the Rankins could have had quite a mess on their hands. Oh, look, an apple got caught. I'll get it. No, no don't. <laughs> oh. 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 <sighs> Here, George, you earned it. <laughs> George appreciated it, but he'd had enough apples for one day.